Each year in the U.S., doctors diagnose about 13,000 women with cancer of the cervix. Tonight, a potentially life-saving reminder from Forest General Health. Your Healthy Minute, a health and wellness resource provided by Forest Health. Dr. Amanda Sellers explains the importance of regular cervical cancer screenings, signs and symptoms to look for, and which patients are most at risk. The cervix is part of the uterus. The uterus is the womb that where you carry a baby during pregnancy. We can test for cancerous cells of the cervix, and we do that through pap smears. So we recommend starting pap smears at age 21, regardless of sexual activity. HPV is human papillomavirus. It's a virus that's spread through sexual contact, uh, but it's extremely common. So it's not quite like many of the other STDs that people have heard about. There aren't actually signs of HPV. You wouldn't know if you had that a virus. That's why it's so important to get your uh, routine screening with pap smears. This is not an exam that people typically want to do, but it's really, really important because there are many types of female cancers that can be prevented with routine visits. We recommend that patients come in starting at age 15 to, or 16 to get established with an OBGYN so they feel comfortable seeing him or her by the time that they would recommend uh, exams, and that's at 21. We do recommend that pap smear start at age 21, and if normal, we see you annually with pap smear screening every three years.